This is a mailbag thing. Um, I was going to wait until I had a pile up of stuff, but uh, this is quite a good one. Look what comes. Well, I didn't order this, obviously, but it's not quite my thing, but um, I thought that was quite interesting. Nice little touch by the side. Um, I bought a uh, OCXO, which I thought I'd need for repairing the fluke. Because that OCXO was faulty, wasn't it? Which I managed to repair though, so that wasn't too bad. But let's just have a look at this thing. Interestingly, I ordered a, well, purchased a 10 megahertz unit. And well, so it's been so slightly concerning, really. And here it says OCXO 1.0. I didn't see me a one there, you know. So this is why I'm opening it up now instead of waiting. So let's have a look, what's it saying there? Output 10 megahertz. So it's just light is not good, there we go, that's better. Alright, so that's alright. 10 megahertz, that's what I wanted. Um I should have to go and check the oh there we go. There's the markings on there. So, you can see what the actual pinouts are. 10 megahertz out, 12 volts, ground, and control, voltage control, well, focus and control, adjustment thing, trimmer. There's a middle leg there which isn't marked, but anyway, it's probably just no ground. Anyway, so, yes. So, I just wanted to do that one get out of the way. So, make sure it's okay. Now, I've hooked it up to power. Let's uh, turn it on. And get the wire out of the way. We'll see what happens. Oh, it's on. 450 milliamps. And frequency, I've got the probe set up there to go to the counter. And that's all getting. So give us some time to warm up, and I'll come back to that and see what it actually ends up coming out like. But it looks like it actually works. So the current started dropping down now, which means it's probably just about to set temperature, which is pretty quick actually. And uh, there we go. It's pretty good. So I'll give it some time to stabilise, and I'll do a bit more. Um, it's interesting to see you've got VFC 2.96 written on the back of this, because it's got a VFC pin here, which is supposed to compensate for frequency if you need to, which is which could be handy, but slightly off. But um, Looks pretty good right now. Alright, so this has now been on for about 20 minutes or so. Voltage just settled down, was it? About 160 milliamps. And that's the frequency. So uh, that's stabilised quite nicely. It actually reached about uh, 460 at the end um, quite quickly, and this has sort of dropped about 15 from that point. And it's, yeah, it's actually quite a good doors. XO, this one. I don't know how it goes as far as. Um, Long term stability, but uh, it's certainly it's quick to work, which is quite good. So, that's the end of that one for now.